hello everyone from now we will start new unit that is unit 5 replication and fault tolerance from this unit at least three question will be asked in exam that will carry at least 20 marks or more than 20 marks in this video we will study about data replication object replication why a replication is needed in distributed systems replication as scaling technique replication management system model or architecture model for management of replicated data so what is data replication Data replication is the process in which data is copied at multiple location to improve the ability of the data. Data is a multiple device or maza duplicate karan like one data replication. What is object replication? Data in the distributed system consists of collection of items. These items are called objects. And objects can be file or objects generated by the programming paradigm. Object replication is the mechanism to form Physical replicas such as object is stored at single computer and tied to some degree of consistency. There are two approaches for object replication. The application is responsible for replication and the system or middleware handles the replication. Here is the diagram. Application needs to handle the consistency issue and the consistency issue are handled by the middlewares. It simplifies application development but makes object specific solution handler. There are the two diagrams. This one is for A and this one is for figure B. Why do we need replication? We need replication because it increases the reliability of the system. If one replica is unavailable or crash, then another replica can be used. Protect against corrupted data. Thus, it increases the fault tolerance of the system so that it increases the fault tolerance in the distributed system. It improves the performance of the system that is speed scale with the size of distributed systems and scale in geographically distributed system it also helps in load sharing where loads on the server are shared among different replica it enhances the ability of the data if replica are created and data is stored near to the consumer it will be easier and fast to fetch the data replication as a scaling technique a system is said to be scalable if it can handle the addition of user and resource without suffering the noticeable loss of performance or increase in the administrative complexity. Replication as scaling technique involves creating copies of resource component and distributing them across the system. Multiple copies improves performance by reducing the access latency. There is also one special case of replication which is called caching. It is similar to caching in the sense that caching involves having a copy of resource in a close proximity to the client. It is different from replication in the sense that a caching decision is taken by the client on the demand, whereas a replication decision is made by the owner of the resource and is pre-planned. An example of caching would be a web browser storing a copy of document whose validity have been not verified for some time, some period of time. What is replica manager? Replica means an extra copy and that copy will be managed by the replica manager replica manager is a sub system that is responsible for managing the synchronization of the replica replica refers to a single copy of data in a system that employs replication replica manager holds various replica and performs operation upon them it acts as a server in the client environment a collection of replica manager provides service for the client here is the architecture model of replicate data or system model. Here two clients are connected with front end and there are different replica manager which give the service to the front end. Client requests replicas and the replica manager gives reply to the front end and front end will give reply to the clients. There are five phases in performing the request. Front end issue the request either sends to a single replica or multicast to all the replica manager it will send a single replica or it will multicast to other replica manager coordination replica manager coordinates in preparation for the execution of the request that is agree if request is to be performed and the ordering of the request relative to other ordering can be fifo first in first out casual total or sequential ordering execution may be tentative or not fully agreed upon agreement agree to comment or abort in a transactional system Res response one or more replica manager
passes a response back to the front end this replica manager will give response back to the front end this is the architectural model now in next video we will discuss about replication technique for fault tolerance services thank you for watching till now if you are new then please share and subscribe the channel so that it can be reached out to many people thank you